This is YSM Sports Media. I want to thank you for all your love and support. Really appreciate it. We wouldn't be able to do this without you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now and click the notification button for all future content. I don't know if you notice Ivan Redcatch and Javante Davis yeah. going back and forth <laughs> <laughs> on social media yeah. about the sparring situation. Yeah. What's your thoughts on leaking sparring? And oh, le leaking sparring and not the whole session, just the clip. All right. If we're not going to leak sparring, why we started? Like, why do we start doing that? You know what I mean? That's not if we're going to cry about it now. But... I don't like I don't like that. Like like if I if I, if I let if I let one of my guys work with somebody and they leak some sparring out like that, that'd be the last time they get some work from us. We done. And if and if any chance they can fight, yeah, we have them fight. Cause I want that back. You know what I mean? For trying to play us. Not for the for the work, for trying to play us though. Because we all had bad days in work. But the part where you try to play like you guys like you dealing with some type of monster, that's a little, you know what I mean? But in Tank's defense, looking at that, it looked like it was a mutual thing. You know why? It was guys in the gym. Because even if that didn't get out on tape, it was going to get out through word of mouth. It was guys, It was a lot of guys in the gym. A couple of them that I even know. I got their numbers and everything. So I'm like, damn. It wasn't like it was a shut off thing. It was open. Um, the little clips, the videos that he showed, uh, Tank, Tank was getting off for sure. He definitely for sure hurt Ivan Redcock. He jumped out the ring basically like out of, out of disgust. Like, like, this guy not no work for me. So he jumped out. Redcock probably felt like you disrespected me because we were scheduled for six. But maybe he would have been hurt real bad by six. Because that was four that he hopped out on. And he was getting beat on. So, I mean, you know, I don't I don't know. Honestly, I don't like it. But, I mean, what am, what can I do? That's the days and time now. Show and spar. Yeah, you know. And from, from what I remember, that was, like, completely taboo. Like sparring, you know, whatever happens in the gym stays in the gym. Right. But I guess in social media age, it's a little different. Yeah, game opened up now because what happened is a lot of people are getting famous, internet famous, off of these sparring tapes. Devin Haney, Devin Haney made his name off of sparring tapes, believe it or not. Even though he had a good amateur name, the, the sparring tape helped because that kept, kept the people up to date with what was going on with Devin Haney. So they show a lot of sparring. But there's also some sparring tapes out there I know they don't want to get out. Or they probably paid for them not to come out or whatever. You know what I mean? It, that's the game though. Gotta be careful, that's all. Be careful. That's how you know all work ain't good work though. That, that's why you shouldn't, have, you shouldn't jump for work. Just because you see somebody come in the building. Don't jump to get in there with them because you don't know what tip they on. You know what I mean? Ivan Redcash is um, supposedly preparing for Sean Porter. Fight Sean Porter? Yeah. Mm. And uh, Tank, I guess what, Leo Santa Cruz? Mm-hmm. I, I was impressed even if it, if it was just a snippet, watching Tank hurt 147 pounds. Mm, yeah. But a wear and tear, 147 will wear and tear on him. A 147 will wear and tear on him. And Tank, Tank wasn't. He not in his tear weight. He wasn't down to 130, 135. He, no. he probably 135. <laughs> yeah. So he feel like a gorilla. And you see this guy balance isn't what it should be. The balance isn't what it should be. He's standing on his tippy toes and driving the left hand. He trying to kill him. He pulling it from his hips all the way down. Pulling it back down. I mean, that was going to happen with that type of guy because he, he can't get away from it. I mean, that guy can't even though he a little bigger, he can't get away from it. So, because cause I bet you this, if Tank hit a heavyweight like that, yeah, he hurt him. Because he can punch. He just one of them guys. But I wasn't impressed because it's Ivan Radcock. You know what I'm saying? He not the best defensive fighter around. You know what I mean? If you show me a tape of that, Tank doing that to Shakur, then I'll be like, oh, shit. Tank wants some shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? But he doing that to Ivan Radcock. Ivan Radcock is a punching bag right now. You know?